What is a function? Before we talk about what a function is, let's talk about juicers. If I have a juicer, and let's say I want to make orange juice, all I have to do is put an orange in the juicer, and out will come orange juice. Anytime I put an orange in the juicer, it'll make orange juice for me. My input would be that orange into the juicer, and my output is the juice that comes out of the juicer. Notice that if I were to put grapes into the juicer, I couldn't expect to get orange juice out of the ju juicer. I would get grape juice. And if I put an apple in the juicer, I'll get apple juice. So for each type of fruit I put in the juicer, I'll get that same type of juice out. This is kind of like a function. f of x equals 2x plus 1 is a good example of a function. And you can think of f of x as a machine, kind of like a juicer. But instead of putting fruit in this machine, we're going to put numbers. And for each number we put into this machine, we can expect to get one number out of the machine. So for instance, if I take the number 3 and I put it in this function, this machine, I can expect to get one number out. And that number we can get by plugging in 3 into our function. Here's what we mean by that. f of 3 is going to be 2 times, so we have an x here, we're going to replace it with a 3. So we have 2 times 3 plus 1. And that equals 6 plus 1, which is 7. So when I put 3 into this function, I can expect to get 7 out of it. Anytime I put 3 into this function, I'll get 7 out. In fact, for any number that I put into this function, there's only one number that will come out of the function. That's the definition of a function. Here's one more example of a function f of x equals 2 times x plus 3. Now we won't actually draw out a picture of a machine every time we want to evaluate a function at a given number. But we can keep that picture in your mind to understand what's going on. Here, let's evaluate f of 4 for practice. So f of 4 equals 2, and now we're going to replace x with 4 plus 3, and then we, go, then we just need to calculate what this is. So we have 2 times 4 plus 3, which is 7, and that leaves us with 14. So we know that f of 4 equals 14. 